welcome back to my channel guys thank you so much for coming back here so today guys in this video i'm gonna be making this amazing delicious apple pie so allow me to introduce you to all the ingredients that i will be using in this recipe today i'm gonna be using two and a half cups of all-purpose flour half tablespoons of granulated sugar half teaspoons of salt and half pound of cold and salted butter six to seven tablespoons of ice cold water <laughs> thank you so much guys for your love thank you so much for your support and if you're new here please do remember to hit that red subscription button and turn on your post notification bell to all so you will not miss out on my next upload thank you so much so I'm combining all the dry ingredients right now guys now I'm now I'm going to add my butter yes guys this apple pie oh my god it is gonna be the bomb <laughs> so guys i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna combine the butter into the flour and i will continue doing this until i get it looking like breadcrumbs yes guys that is the look i'm looking for today This is the texture I'm looking for, guys. Look at this. This is so perfect. Okay, guys. So now I'll proceed and I'll add my six to seven tablespoons of ice cold water to my dry ingredients. on to the next step guys so now I'll combine the flour so now guys I'll throw it out on the mat so you can see better what I am doing basically I'm not kneading the dough I'm just going to pull the dough together so it can stick forming it like a dough ball Now I'll section the dough. This is what your pie dough should look like, guys. Now I'll wrap the dough into the plastic wrap, guys. And if you don't have plastic wrap, you can also put it in Ziploc bag. guys I will rest these dough in the refrigerator for one hour here are my apples guys and I'm going to be using eight apples so I'm gonna go ahead now and start peeling my apples after I finish peeling the apples I'm gonna go ahead and slice them into thin slices glory, glory to God in the highest glory glory to God in the highest your love lifted me your love lifted me free to sing of your love mm -hmm. 
me No me to God So guys, this is how you want to cut it Now that I finished cutting the apples guys I'm going to transfer them into my bowl I'm free to sing of your love Your love lifted me guys I'm adding some brown sugar and I'm also going to be adding some cinnamon so guys I will put the link in the description box down below where you can find all the ingredients and the measurements to this recipe thank you so much guys and please do remember to check out the other links that are there in the description box look at those apples guys oh my goodness it smells so good the aroma up in here is so nice guys the mixture from the cinnamon along with these apples that blend oh my gosh the kitchen is smelling so nice so guys i'll turn my stove off right now now I'll move on to rolling out the pie dough and I have a little extra flour here to dust my mat. After I finish rolling the dough guys, I'll use my food scraper to slightly lift the dough up so I can roll it onto my rolling pin because this is the easiest way to get the pie dough into the pie dish. finish molding in my pie dough guys I'm gonna go straight ahead and add in my apple fillings and guys when you're doing this be careful not to get the filling on the edge of the dough because it will make it very difficult to seal
Now I'm cutting out the lid, my little strips that I'm going to be using to make my pie look so fancy. So stick around guys and you'll see what I'm going to be doing next. Now guys, I will tuck in the excess pie dough into the pan around the edges. Once all the edges are tucked in, you can crimp or float through the edges of the pie dough and this process guys is so easy, simple but trust me, it will make your pie looking super fancy. Beat together one egg, one tablespoon of sugar, brush the egg wash over the surface of the dough. This will add beautiful color to your pie while it is baking. Transfer it to the center of a preheat oven and bake it on 425 degrees Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. Without opening the door, reduce the heat to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and continue baking for 45 minutes. Now it's time guys to take the pie out of the oven and I'm so excited. I can't wait to show you guys what this pie is looking like. Oh my 
my goodness look at this pie guys look at this yummy delicious mouth watering oh my goodness guys it smells so good look at this pie guys look how beautiful this pie is looking look at the color it is so beautiful guys wow oh my god guys and i cannot cut the pie as yet guys because you know when you bake pie you have to at least let the pie rest for one hour it has to cool properly because then you don't want to cut into your into your pie and then your pie sliding all over the plate guys gotta make sure it is cooled properly before you cut into it look how pretty look oh my god guys this pie is smelling so good this pie is tasty this pie is so delicious thank you all so much guys and remember guys to share this video out remember to like guys remember to leave me a comment and tell me what you think about my pie and this apple pie is great for the holiday thanksgiving christmas new year's Put it on your table guys thank you so much guys remember if you're new here do not leave it out hitting the red subscription button turn on your post notification bell and also you will not miss out on any of my uploads thank you so much thank you thank you and blessings to everyone i appreciate you guys so much i could have never done it without you so i'm so grateful Thank you guys, thank you, thank you. Guys, it seems rough and tough and you know sometimes you probably feel as if you can't bother and you wanna give up, just don't give up, okay? Hold on. He'll do it again, do it again. He'll do it again. Don't you know God has not changed? You may not know how, you may not know where, but he'll do it again, do it again, he'll do it again. Just take one look of where you are now and where you have been. He will always come through for you. He's the same now as then. Don't you know God has not changed? You may not know how. You may not know where. But he'll do it again. Yes, guys. Hold on, my friend. Hold on. Hold on, my brothers. Hold on, my sisters. Hold on, my friends. Hold on. Don't give up. Don't give up. Guys, thank you so much again. And I hope someone was encouraged by my few little words or even by the little, you know, song that I sung because there's a lot of message in that song. So I hope someone was encouraged today. Bye for now, guys. See you again in another video. Take care. Bye-bye.